Uh, Jasmine Sanders, 10 things cheaters always say by somebody I won't mention. Meg but Butler you from Mad Noir. Uh, number 10, I'm a private person. That's why my yeah. phone is always locked. Yeah, you don't need I'm that. very private. Yeah. People in my business. Number 9 of the top 10 things cheaters always say, you know your friends are just hating on me. They hate. That's all. Yeah. yeah they just trying, trying, to yeah. Be quiet. trying to make you lonely like they are. Don't right. right. So stop it. <laughs> Number eight of the top ten things cheaters always say. I don't know whose shirt that is. <laughs> I just buy my clothes extra large. That's all. <laughs> Number seven of the top ten things cheaters always say. I'm telling the truth this time. Yeah, this time. Don't worry. <laughs> Stop bringing up old stuff. Come on. Right, right, right. Jeez. Number six of the top ten things cheaters always say. That girl, that boy is crazy. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. She crazy, girl. You know Never you, crazy. just the Number five of the top ten things cheaters always say, I did not have sexual relations with that person. Mm-mm. And then you get impeached. What happened today anyway, huh? <laughs> yes. That's, uh... Number four of the top ten things cheaters always say, what had happened was. Yeah. Oh. yeah. Number three of the top ten things cheaters always say, I would never cheat on you. Never. Mm. Come on That means now. I did. Number two of the top ten things cheaters always say, I don't know who that baby is. Oh, ooh. <laughs> ooh, that ain't got deep. Uh-huh. And the number one of the top ten things cheaters always say, you know they're just a friend. Yeah. Let me tell you something. Next time we got to do this, Skip, give me a warning. I don't need to hear it. <laughs> <laughs> this is great. All right, coming up, we got a, uh, I'm about to give you a little note from the GED section. That's up in 15 minutes. It's the D.L. Hughley Show. The most laughs in your afternoon are heard here on the D.L. Hughley Show. A 46-year-old Italian man faced his neighbors in court complaining of his loud lovemaking, saying he was disturbing the peace. He ended up with a six-month jail sentence. We're going to see how good he is now. (laughs) This is the D.L. Hughley Show. (laughs) 